All right, so it is Monday, 7.14, and I'm gonna be leaving in a couple of minutes. And this is my outfit. The top is from New York and Company, and then these bottoms are from Old Navy. I did not sleep well last night. Like, my stomach was hurting. It still kind of hurts, but not as bad as it was hurting before. <sighs> but, yeah. So, I'm hoping today will go smoothly. Um, I think we're going to be going to the computer lab instead of getting laptops because retesting is supposed to be over. I guess we'll find out if that's true or not. And then, I know on Friday they have field day, but I think the rest of the week is just gonna be regular, regular, regular week. Hopefully, they will be able to go outside. Cause I think like, three days last week they weren't able to go outside. Uh -uh. Trying to see what the temperature is now because it was being like cold in the morning and then like warm it up later except for Friday. Friday was just cold like all day. I um, blended my smoothie and packed up my lunch and I'm probably going to take some because I need to get ready to head out so I will talk with you guys probably later today maybe. All right, so it is 3.23 and I'm back home after stopping by Starbucks. I got the uh, s'mores frappuccino because they still have been the half off or whatever. Uh, but today was eh. I don't know what. Some of them just came in the classroom like off the chain already. I'm like, it's too early for this. Uh, like the kindergarten student. Mm, I don't think she can write. Well, I don't know. Like before, she would go to like daycare one day a week, like every Monday. But now, I guess and she's going every day. And yeah. But she came in like hitting uh, one of the parrots. And then she like ran off. So the, the parrot had to like walk around the school to find her. And then like she went to the nurse and somehow injured herself in the nurse's office <laughs> yeah and then another student got hit with the chair like purposely hit like i don't know if the person like threw the chair and it hit him or he held it and hit him but yeah then another student he was just whiny all day long and then like one student pressed a button on his laptop and he got upset and threw the laptop on the ground. That's why, you know, they took the computers out in the first place. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> but I come to find out that one student who's been whining, apparently he hasn't been on his medication, so that's why, because it's like, it's a complete different when he is on it. Everybody else was pretty okay. One student left early because um, he's going to be getting his medication. So he's like, we should hopefully. Well, I don't know. I guess it depends on how long it takes to actually get in his system. So. Although today he was actually pretty quiet. Probably though because he brought his phone to class to school. Third grader. What, do, what does a third grader need with the phone? I don't know. But yeah. So basically he was on his phone all day. One of my classmates asked if my paper was graded and no it hasn't been graded yet but grades aren't due until the 10th and then they're supposed to be official on the 14th and knowing our professor she'll probably wait to the very last day that she couldn't submit them <laughs> but hopefully i'll be able to go to sleep early today that's the plan. I'm probably going to take my z -Quil, like at 7 because <laughs> it takes a while for it to kick in. So I would like to be asleep by 8.30. That's the plan. We shall see. But that is it for today. I did go to the library over the weekend. Checked out a couple of books. So that's basically what I'll be doing today. I still haven't heard anything from HR yet. But I will just talk with you guys in the morning. All right, so it is Tuesday morning, 7.14, and this is my outfit. 
This top is from H&M and then these bottoms are from Old Navy. <laughs> but actual retesting for the Georgia milestones is actually this week, not last week. I don't know why that person told us it was last week because not. <laughs> so yeah, we have to basically get the laptops again because we can't go into the computer lab because that's where they're doing the testing. Hopefully today will be a bit calmer today than it was yesterday. Uh, I need to start getting ready to head out. And I'm still waiting for my phone to charge some because for some reason when I woke up it was like at 50 something percent. I don't know why. <sighs> so I'm gonna wait a couple of more minutes and then I'll be on my way. So I will talk with you guys later. Alright, so it is Wednesday, 7 14, and this is my outfit. This top is from New York and Company, and then the bottoms are from H&M. <laughs> Yesterday was, uh, I guess it wasn't as bad as Monday because no one got hit with the chair and nobody threw a computer on the ground, but in other ways, it was worse. Like, <clears throat> I don't know. A lot of whining and yelling and crying. <laughs> <sighs> then <clears throat> so I'm extra tired this morning because I didn't go to sleep till like 3 in the morning partly because uh, two of my classmates actually were texting me about grades until like maybe 11 something and then I was reading a book and <laughs> I just got so into the book that I just wanted to like read the whole thing so yeah I'm super tired I was thinking about going to Starbucks but I don't think I have enough time now <sighs> but for me I have exactly two more weeks left at the school I'm currently at because my last day there will be on a Wednesday although school year isn't over until a Friday <coughs> So ready for it to be summer and for me to be able to sleep in <laughs> while I still can. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, but that is it. I need to go ahead and get ready to head out. So I will just talk with you guys later. All right, so it is Thursday, 7:15, and this is my outfit. Top is from Macy's, and then bottoms are from Old Navy. But Yesterday it was uh, <laughs> really it's these two students who get on each other's nerves basically. So they like always like every day there's an issue with those two between those two basically. <laughs> but then later on they'll be friends. <laughs> so we did have a couple of issues basically with those two students. Everybody else was okay. But we kind of changed things up a little bit. Um, so we did morning work and then we went outside at 9. Because uh, nobody else goes outside at that time. And our normal time is supposed to be 12 to 12.30. But it's just too hot for that. Like, <laughs> So. And then we came back in and did some more work. And then we went to the computer lab. And then lunch. And then they came back to the classroom. Ate their lunch. And then we gave them the laptops. So that work kind of split things up so we're not just sitting in the room all day long and to me it kind of seemed to make the morning go by faster because the morning seems to drag on forever <laughs> yeah <clears throat> but uh the whole day is supposed to be tomorrow but they canceled it because it's supposed to rain or storm or something so they moved it to next wednesday Yesterday I was so tired I ended up taking a nap like around five something. Yeah. It was only like an hour nap though but when I woke up because it's like six almost 6 30 ish and I woke up thinking it was 6 30 in the morning. <laughs> so I was like panicking my heart was beating fast. I was like oh my god I overslept I'm gonna be late but I was like wait no. 
because it's only 6.30 in the evening. But I was still able to fall asleep at a decent time last night too, so that's good. I don't feel too tired today. Hmm. It would be nice if one of the one of those students were absent for a couple of days. That would be nice. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, I guess I can start heading out. I know. Might wait a couple of minutes because there's no reason for me to get there super early just to sit around and do nothing. But I will talk with you guys later. All right, so it's 3:17 and I am home. I didn't stop anywhere today <laughs> today was eh, it was okay there were a couple of issues but not nothing too too serious and then tomorrow is Friday yay <laughs> but um, right when I was getting ready to leave the school I noticed that I had a voicemail and I called it and it was from the school district calling to um, get some information because for some reason my social security number was incorrect like the last number was wrong so uh, then she also told me to fill out an application so they have like all that stuff or something i don't know like for that specific school but they don't have any special ed like applications for that school so she told me to fill out um the middle grade math one that they had or the math position that they have and then to call her back to let her know that that's complete and then I also need to get in contact with my advisor they also need a form saying that I'm in the program or whatever that I'm almost done luckily they have all my like my official transcripts and stuff so Hopefully my advisor will be in his office. I don't know. This is like the end of the semester. Although Thursday he's normally like on Thursdays he's normally uh, they're late supposedly. Like Thursday's supposed to be his late day. So yeah, so I'm going to do that and that's basically it. And so I would just talk with you guys probably in the morning. Right, so it is Friday, 7:19, and this is my outfit. Um, just this top from G S loves me, and then these skinny jeans, and yeah, that's basically it. Actually, does it look like it's going to rain today? I'm not surprised, really, because I wasn't able to finish that application last night because I needed one more reference, and uh, I was able to ask. Um, my former NCO, he would be a reference, and he said yes. So I was able to put that information in, and I just finished the application this morning. So I'm about to find some time to call the person that I spoke with yesterday. Today, I don't know exactly when, because I don't know when they start work, because you know it's the district office, not like a school. So, and then, yeah, basically, since I'm with the students all day. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna have to find some time to call. Maybe when, either when they go outside this morning or when they go to the computer lab, I might be able to call her real quick. And also, my advisor, I tried calling yesterday. He's already gone. Like, I knew that he didn't, like, because I had him as a professor for one of my classes, and he was saying that every summer, him and his family go to Michigan they spend the summer in Michigan basically so I kind of knew that he wouldn't be here I just didn't think he was going to leave that early like yeah but he said the best way to contact him was via email or you could just leave a voice message and you would check those so I sent him an email I don't know when he's going to check it especially since you know he's like the program director for a couple of different for like the MAT in the MED program so <laughs> and he's also an advisor and I know he's going to be teaching summer classes so I'm thinking he probably gives a ton of emails so who knows because <laughs> I sent him an email earlier was it this week or the end of last week and I never heard anything back from him so I don't know if he did what I needed him to do or not because he had to like send 
an email to somebody else on my behalf. I don't know if he did that because he never responded. So, I think I need to bring the sweater because when that air conditioner be kicked on, it gets cold. I swear in the morning, the time seems to go by extra fast. Like, <laughs> I looked at the clock at one time and it was 7.15. And then like, I swear it was a minute later, it was already 7.18. I'm like, seriously? But I will just talk to you guys when I get home this afternoon. All right, so it's like 3.43 and I am home. Um, I didn't leave this school till like maybe 3.10-ish and then I stopped by Starbucks. But today, as not like horrible, but things didn't really go as planned. Um, and really it's just two students who would be causing problems. We weren't able to get the laptops. So it's like we go to the computer lab at the time that we, it's our scheduled time or whatever, but we was only in there for maybe 10 minutes before another class came in and the teacher was like, uh, it's our time now we have, I don't know, I guess the schedule change if they're doing testing, but so we had to leave. Surprisingly, nobody threw a fit. <laughs> And I think in part is because when they were outside the first time, A, they were outside for like almost an hour. Well, no, maybe like 45 minutes. And they found frogs. So, like they weren't as upset that things didn't go as they normally would. And then, so we had lunch and then went back outside for like maybe another 45 minutes. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. But then on Monday, um, the behavior tech is going to be across the hall in the other classroom because that the teacher for that classroom, I guess, is going to be out. And instead of them getting a sub, they decided just to take the behavior tech for her, her class all day. I guess more retesting will be done on Monday. I think two or two, two or three of ours will be doing retesting. But I don't know how Monday's going to go. Mondays normally aren't the worst, but I don't know. It might be a little different, especially if they see her and know that she's across the hall. That might cause some problems. And if we can't get the laptops or go to the computer lab, that will also be a problem. Otherwise, I would say overall the week wasn't the most horrible <laughs> has it been the best either but things could be worse and we only have 10 more days and for me eight more days at that school I did call that um the person that i spoke to yesterday from hr and she um said she'll give me a call back either today or monday and i'm guessing it's going to be monday because she said she's going to be out of the office the rest of the day I think that's basically it. I don't have any plans this weekend except to do my hair. Probably gonna put it in a puff just because I don't feel like spending a bunch of hours on my hair. So I'll probably do that and read and hopefully finish those two books so I could just go to the library tomorrow and I need to get a new library card because mine is about to expire. I guess it last for two years. So I need to go to the store to buy more things for our classroom store or whatever and i'll probably just go to the dollar tree and get some snacks because they love any food or candy i don't like yeah so i'll probably do that and i also went to wash and vacuum my car this weekend it didn't rain <laughs> i was like it would be really funny if it rained on wednesday because that's when the that's where they when they moved the field day too because they thought it was going to rain today um, I got a t-shirt for that day. I didn't realize like I don't I don't know because I did get one for stem day So I don't know if the money covered both of the shirts, but I didn't pay for Two shirts like I didn't even know there's going to be a field day shirt. But I'm like, okay I'll go to church on Sunday. Yeah, that's basically going to be my weekend um, Yeah, so that is going to be it for this week's vlog. Thank you for watching and I will see you next week